Good morning, guys. Finally, after weeks, we will speak about cameras and stereo cameras. What we can use today? The Z. Uh, the Z. This is the camera I'm using for this starting video. Another camera is the Raspberry Pi camera. And after, the Econ System uh, camera from the Jetson Nano. What uh, they are in particular? The first two are connected directly to the Jetson Nano. The Z is connected by USB 3 to the Jetson Nano. Let's go! Now we can see in detail how their camera works. Ok, now we can start to unbox uh, three different type of uh, cameras. The Z, the Econ System box and the Raspberry Pi camera. In this case, we have the camera module, the cable, SD card for the Jetson Nano, ready with all drivers, ready to run. And the optical camera part. The last part we have the camera model. Now we can start to speak about the Z stereo camera. The Z stereo camera has two cameras, a USB 3 connector, and their max resolution is 2K. To use the Z stereo camera, you can download or can use this USB card inside the uh, box. This uh, USB card has the drivers for Windows and for Linux or for the Nvidia Jetson. But I suggest to download the last release of the uh, Z drivers. Have this stand really useful for human activity. You can plug amount and calibrate the position and finally inside this box you have a short readme to all to install the Z and all its work with it. Okay now we can start to use it. can go in, uh, to the full um, tools folder is located in ESR local Z tools we have different type of example Z calibration Z deep viewer Z diagnostic Z explorer Z foot and Z SVO editor but I would like to show in particular Z explorer and Z deep viewer and Z foot I start now with Z Explorer. 
we can see, and I can see me uh, in the camera. We have the stream from the left and right camera at the maximum frame rate. The uh, performance of GPU is not really used, and from the CPU is again not really used. Now I change to the another tools Z Deep Viewer. Now the performance we can see we are close to 100%, but we can see me in 3D. Hello. This is the same application from the first part of this video. Now I would like to change with the last tools called ZFU. With this application, we can make a 3D map from the camera. Now I start the live. Okay. Take the camera. And start. No. Retry again. And we try again. Oh, okay. We can see on right the status of the 3D map. If I move really slowly, we can see other information. And, and, and. I stop the record and we can see the information of the visual odometry, the path, and the map recorded works really well on the Jetson Nano. Sometimes it doesn't start at the first time, but it's good. And if you know my project with my robot, I use it a lot, the Z stereo camera, with my robots, example Panther and Dude. Now I would like to use the Z stereo camera and the others camera for, for my new robot. In this video, we have seen the Z stereo camera in action. We have seen how it is works with the Jetson Nano, different type of tools, the Z Explorer, the, the Viewer, and the Z Foo to reconstruct on a 3D map. In the next video, we will see the ecosystem camera presented in the beginning of this video, and for the end of the uh, 3D clips, we will see the Raspberry Pi camera and uh, different information and uh, my comments about these 3D, ca 3, 3D cameras.